Hey guys, this is Eskimo Poodle, and we are back with us to play Cthulhu Saves the World, uh, Cthulhu's Angels Edition on the PC. Last time, we made our way to the spaceship and uh, paused, met themselves with a rather brief uh, introduction and a rather quick end. Yeah, it was unfortunate, but uh, no kitty for us. And today we're going to go ahead and continue on through the area here, see if we can't find all sorts of good stuff, and... Well, see if we can't stop the invasion of the cows, because, well, I don't think they like being kidnapped. It's just something that kind of happens. They don't have a choice in the matter. It's just, uh, well, they can't help it. They're just easily kidnappable. So, yeah. Let's see. Darks. No, not darks. Blood wave. Uh, we need a silver bullet. Uh, the bovinator, because you have a lot of HP. And Ume just goes ham. I love it. Let's see, how much HP do you have left? Not that much, I don't think. Let's see, smash you. And attack you, there we go. How much HP do you got, dude? Jeez. Die. Alright, we gotta figure out a way to get rid of those again. We just gotta find the computer terminals. And hopefully find any treasure chests around here. Uh, that'll probably get rid of most of the red terminals, I do believe. Uh, let's see. If I remember correctly, this floor just had the terminal, pretty much. I don't think it had any treasures. Or did. Okay. Never mind. I was thinking of the wrong thing in a monstrosity, huh? Even the other monsters don't like them. Yeah, gee, I wonder why. Uh, let's see. Let's go with a... Let's go with a fireball on the brain squids. Let's go with a mawfish. Let's go with a. Um, yeah, strength goes 50%. Let's do that first. And then let's also get with a. Silver bullet on one of the brain squids here just to try to get them down. Umi, you do not get stunned. Perfect. Molly, neither did you. I'll take it. October, you are stunned. Damn it. Stop being stunned, please. I don't appreciate that. Okay, uh, let's go with a smash on you, since you're just about dead. Let's go ahead with a blood wave with extra damage. And let's go with a silver bullet with you, monstrosity. Okay, Pume, you're dead. I'll take it. And that worked out pretty good. Okay, there is the treasure, but it's hidden behind a force field of forcibleness. This is not what I'm looking for, but this works. A zap tome that increases our lightning damage, but I'm not worried about that since we only have one lightning ability and it targets individually. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and fireball you guys just to get you out of the way. Let's see, smash. You guys don't have that much HP, so I'm not too worried about it. Mawfish, that's perfect. Let's go ahead with a blood wave just to get those guys in the middle and let's also silver bullet these guys since they have piercing defense or not piercing defense just a uh, high defense there you go okay uh, so we should be able to fireball you guys we should be able to smash you guys we should be able to multi-strike you guys and silver bullet you guys I like how Molly's abilities do not seem to cost a whole lot of uh, MP at the moment so that's really nice Okay, this hopefully gets rid of the blue ones. Yes, it does. Perfect. And three one-ups. I'll take it. Not that we actually need them that much, but it's good enough. And we should be able to find one more, I do believe, right? And another mech. Okay, so let's go with... You know, I'm curious. Does this actually do more damage from lightning? I don't think I actually checked that. Uh, let's go ahead and mop fish for the extra damage. Let's go ahead and... Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and... Plague does not do very much damage, does it? Uh, let's see. Let's go with the Unholy Power. And let's go with the Silver Bullet here. Okay. That actually did a pretty fair amount of damage. I think it does actually take more damage from the Lightning there, so that's nice. Let's see. And it's only slightly more expensive than the Fireball, so that's fine. Okay, now let's go with a smash. Let's go with a wind strike's probably not going to do a whole lot of damage. If 
I had to guess, I'd say the Dark Strike would probably be the least resisted here. And let's go with another Silver Bullet there. Okay, Dark Strike. It was re reduced by a fair amount, so that's unfortunate. Smash, that's also reduced. Will Lightning is the champion there, so I love it. Okay, now. There is... This is just the roundabout to the beginning, I think. Now, there should be another treasure chest in here, I think, right? Or did I already get just the one that was in here? I thought I saw a second one somewhere, but I could be wrong. All right, Fireball. Let's go with the uh, the Gooeys again, just because I don't like them. Uh, the Mawfish. Let's go ahead with a Blood Wave. And let's go with a Silver Bullet. On... Let's try to get the Gooeys out of the way. There you go. Somebody is poisoned. That's no bueno. Okay, let's go hit with Fireball on the Brain Squid. So let's go with Smash on the Bulbinator. Let's go with another Blood Wave. And let's go with another Silver Bullet on Bulbinator. Should be able to kill him. Perfect. I'll take it. Ume, you're just about dead, and I think you're poisoned. So I think you're pretty much uh, posed. Nope, we survived. Barely. But we survived. I'll take it. And up here is... Okay, this is just the roundabout, pretty much. So I don't think there's anything else in here. Alright, let's get out of here then. Let's get back to where we were. And let's get back to... Where'd the stairs go? Fireball on you guys. Uh, let's see. Mawfish. Blood Wave. And Silver Bullet on one of you. It'd be nice if Molly got some form of AoE attack. That'd be nice. I'm not sure how you guys died so fast, but I'll take it. October Tornado targets one group, or Tempest targets all allies. Yeah. See, now with this right here, the targets all enemies is only slightly weaker than the targets the group, so I'm more than happy to take that. Elona, let's see. Mind over matter targets self, strength plus 75%, magic minus 50%, or magic plus 50%. Uh, now, see, the problem with that, Strength plus 75, Magic minus 50, is Ilona is my primary healer since she has Heal All. So, while that might be good just for smashing with the Smash, I'm going to take the Magic because I don't want my healing cut in half. So, yeah. I mean, it's not a bad ability, and if it was for, like, Umi, I might take it. But since it's cutting my healer in to bite-sized chunks of not keeping me alive. I'm going to go ahead and ignore that for the moment. Okay, let's go ahead with the Tempest, see how well it does. Let's go with the Mawfish, let's go with Blood Wave, and Silver Bullet on you. Okay, the Blood Wave does do less damage to the Monstrosity, which is unfortunate. Ow! October, you resisted. Thank you. Okay, they seem to do standard damage to everybody here, so that's perfect. I can just go ahead with uh, Tempest on these guys. I love it. Okay, uh, Smash on... Let's see, 411. I should get the Brain Squid out of here. Uh, let's see, Silver Bullet on you, hopefully. That should be enough to kill everybody. Good, got it. Alright, uh, let's see, what is our... You guys need, like, one more battle, okay. And we have five left. You know, let's go ahead and just get these out of the way. Hello. I love it. Uh, let's see. Let's go with a Tempest. That should be more than enough to kill everybody. And then you guys just, uh, smash these guys here. And Tempest should be more than enough to kill them, I think. And they're all extremely fast now, which kind of sucks. I'll live. Okay, that worked out perfect. Okay, let's see. Curse targets one enemy, adds insanity, resistances minus 50%, or targets all enemies, uh, adds insanity, resistance minus 50%. Uh, really, the only difference is the MP cost uh, and targets everybody. So you can have it really cheap and just use it on like a boss or whatever, or you can have it mu a little bit more expensive and use it on everybody. Um. Uh, Honestly, like I said, I'm not really planning on using the Insanity this, uh, this much. So I'm just going to go with Curse, and if I need to use it on a boss, I will, but I probably won't. 
See, ooh, plus one hit to attack. Yeah, plus one hit to attack is just always too good to pass up, so always take that. Because, as we've discovered, plus one hit to attack basically doubles your attack. I mean, I was thinking about it the wrong way the first time. It feels like I've been on this floor before, but I could be wrong. Okay, uh, let's see. Tempest. Okay, you smash that guy. You... Blood Wave, and then you... Silver Bullet. There we go. Oh, Tempest is actually really cheap, too. 6 MP, that's really nice. Uh, let's see, do we need a Mawfish? Yeah, we do. Blood Wave, and then Silver Bullet on you. There we go. Still a few more battles left. Let's get these out of the way. Yeah, Tempest is only 6 MP and pretty dang good uh, power. It's not as powerful as Fireball, but it's it's got Quake Beat, that's for sure. But then again, Quake does have a combo finisher, so if we do get a high enough combo, that will do plenty of damage. But honestly, Tempest is, Tempest is very mana efficient, and it works, so I'll take it. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead with a Mawfish. Let's go ahead with a Blood Wave and a Silver Bullet on Monstrosities. They have a lot of HP. There you go. I like it. Okay, let's go with a fireball on you guys. Let's go ahead with a smash on you. Let's see, multi strike on you. And silver bullet on you. That should be just enough, I think. Yes, beautiful. I love it. Okay, now we might be slightly lost here because I'm not sure where exactly I am, but that's besides the point. Uh, fireball on the group of nobody. This is Tempest that works. Uh, let's see, smash you. I strike and silver bullet. There we go. And one more. Yeah. Let's see. Tempest works out perfectly. Mawfish. Blood wave and silver bullet. Ow. Oh, mate, you do not like surviving anymore, do you? But, uh,. It's okay, because you do plenty of damage. Okay, a fireball on you guys, that should be fine. Let's see. Smash on you. Silver bullet on you. There we go. Alright, now we can just try to figure out where the heck we're going here. Okay, that looks like either the way we came in or the way out. That's the way we came in. Okay, I thought we were kind of going backwards, but I wasn't entirely sure. You know, the whole no map thing kind of screws me over. Okay, down here. Is there anything worthwhile? Yes, there is. Three potions. I'll take it. And we got plenty of potions. Nice. I think I'm just going to try to save my potions and one-ups for boss fights. Because there's no point uh, constantly reviving Ume since she's just going to die from blood waving the enemies to death. So I'm not really too worried. Okay, I want to get right there. I just got to figure out where that is. Right here. Perfect. Or maybe not. Okay. Okay, let's try over here then. This should be more or less where I want to go, right? Yes. Right. Vampire Whip. Cool. Yeah, that sounds like it's going to do yay old, uh... Okay, I thought I was going to do uh, HP Drain, but okay, that works too. Um... Yeah, Dark Plus 50. Yeah, we... We don't have any dark right now, but if we get the void ability, which I'm pretty sure we will, then that'll be useful. That should be useful for later. Now, let's see if we can't find any more computer terminals to screw around with. This was... I think we're, we already went over there. That took us up to the next floor in order to get rid of the uh, red lasers, I do believe. Over here... We got distracted from something. Um, yeah, that stair right there, that was the way that we already went. The red lasers are not up. One of the lasers we got rid of, though. I'm not sure which one, but whatever. Okay, that computer right there, we need to get to that, but I don't think we're going to at this point. Okay, right there would be nice to get to. That's where we already got, right? 
I'm pretty I'm pretty sure we were just here. Okay, I'm gonna see if there's another computer terminal that I missed. Because I know we got one of them at least, and that turned off the something or other. I'm not sure if we missed anything else though, that's the question. Oh, we missed that, obviously. Yeah, that's not going to turn anything off right there. Ooh, there's a save point right here. I guess if we wanted to, we could just finish up the area, really. You know, I might as well. I mean, I'll try to get this. I'll try to get this last uh, treasure chest here, but I'm not going to go out of my way to pretend to care at this point. I mean, we get the treasures, we get out of here, we're done. Uh, especially if I figure out where I'm going. Yeah, like not there, like over here. Yeah. 3,500 gold, not bad. And I think I saw the computer over here. No, that was just the test tubes. Uh, let's see, that's the way out. Uh, we're all healed up and everything. Alright, we'll spend a few minutes looking around for a computer terminal to figure out how to deactivate everything. I think that's going to be it right there. But if we can't actually, like, turn everything off... And, oh well, we tried. The laser barrier has been activated. Okay, so this is deactivated. That's the one we already got. Now, if there's another computer terminal around here, I'm not sure where it's at. Eh, it's not over here. Unless we just didn't go this way. Or we just didn't see it this way. No, we got... That's the way in. Hmm. Huh. That's a dead end. Ish. No, we're just going in circles right now. Okay, let's go back to the second floor real fast and uh, take another gander at that. If we don't find it in, like, a few minutes, I'll just say screw it and... Continue on. And you know what? Hang on a second. Just to make my life a little easier here. Not that. That's not making my life too easy. I want to get back to the save point real fast. I'll make a save, and if we don't find the computer switch, then I'll just uh, reload over here. And that way I don't got to walk all the way back. Okay, so save. Let's save slot C here. Yeah, let me just picture here. I don't think these are doing anything now. Yeah, the laptops aren't doing anything, unfortunately. So we'll just have to suffer. This is not quite where I'm trying to go here. Okay, this should take us right back to the stairwell of the entrance, and that will be fine. Maybe there was another computer terminal on the first floor. Eh. Whatever. Okay, I thought this was going to take me right back to where I wanted to go. It does. Okay, I just went the wrong path, that's all. Okay, let's see here. Red. No bueno. Okay, I want to get to that right there. If I could get to that, that'd be awesome. Um, then again, that might... No, I think that was the one that turned off the ones on the first floor, right? Okay, if we can get right there, that'd be pretty cool, too. But the problem is, is there any way to actually get there? That's the question. No, okay, that is the one from the first floor right there. So, yeah, we've already activated this terminal over here. This computer has already been activated. So we want to activate that one on the left to get rid of these reds. The question is, how do we get to the one on the left? I'm not entirely sure about that. And if we go all the way over here, this might be exactly what we're looking for. Okay. Okay, that was easy enough, I guess. Now the question is, are we actually going to get anything out of that? Let's see. For all I know, we could have deactivated that and actually not have a whole lot of... Uh, tangible rewards for it. Because I'm not sure if there's any actual treasure chests left in the area here. I mean, this... 
back on the first floor. Okay. Was there anything on the first floor that I forgot to get? No, we got those. We got most of this, actually. I don't think there's anything on the first floor that we missed. And if there is, well, I'm not too terribly concerned. Let's see, here is the... Okay, here's the exit right here. I'm going to go left a little bit, see if there's any uh, visible treasure chest. If I don't see anything in like the first like few feet and I have to make too many turns, I'll go back and say screw it. Yeah, I don't think we, I don't think there's anything here. Okay. So let's go back to the second floor, check out for lasers. If I don't find anything, I'm just going to reload and not worry about it cuz it might just be a laser to deactivate just for the sake of deactivating the laser and not actually, you know, providing any anything at all. Okay, so this is right where we were, right here. Here was the laser right here that was blocking our path. This right here goes up to the third floor, right? Yeah, okay, that goes up to the third floor. This right here goes over here. Nothing. Just want to make sure here. For all I know, I could be missing like the best secret ultimate weapon in the game, but probably not. Yeah, I don't think there's actually anything here. I mean, unless there's some extra secret hidden path, I'm not seeing anything, so. Let's go ahead and take on the boss. Uh, probably not pause, it'll probably be uh, Captain McBeef. Yeah, you're not paused this time, that's for sure. Intruders, I was hoping you would show your faces here. We're not afraid of you. You should be. I'm not one of your ordinary genetically genetically engineered cow soldiers. I've been mutated by the potent U virus and integrated with some of the most advanced weaponry this side of the Gamma Quadrant. I have the ultimate killing machine. Wrong! The ultimate killing machine is me, if you beg, unless you claim second place, though. Uh. So there were these three guys, and one of them said that the other guys only told lies, but the other guy said, Psst, what are you doing? It's a robot. I'm going to make it self-destruct the paradox. Too late. Here it comes. Yeah, we should have done a better paradox destruction thingy here. 24,000 HP. That's not too shabby. One of many letter-based mutations. Okay, cool. Uh, let's go ahead and start with the... Now I'm curious. If I fragile this, will that will that make the poison more effective later? Uh, let's see. Target all allies. Holy plus 50%. That'll just be good for healing, actually. Um, let's do that real fast. Uh, you go with a... Unholy power real quick. Perfect. Four machine gun hits. That's not good, but I'll take it. Okay, now. No, it's not going to do extra damage. Oh well. But we still want to poison you, though. So that's that. Actually, hang on. Uh, Unite, is there anything that I care about? Stats plus 20 for everybody. Let's do that real fast, actually. Uh, you go with a Mawfish. You go with a Silver Bullet to start. Perfect. I'm going to need to heal, like, right away here. Okay, uh, now you go with a Fragile. You go with a Heal All. You go with a... Uh, let's see... We already got poison. Uh, let's go ahead with a... Let's start building up the multi-strike here. And then you go with another silver bullet. Actually, no. Moon Howl. There we go. That works. There we go. Okay, perfect. Fragile did not seem to actually do anything. Probably because I meant to cast... Um, I meant to cast Deadly Kiss, not Fragile. There we go. Okay, you continue with the heal all. I'm just going to have you on healing duty, pretty much. You multi-strike. And I realize that multi-strike's not doing a whole lot because it's just going to go ahead and uh, be used up on the heal all, but I'll take it. Okay, that works. Alright, lots of damage to October. That's not actually good, but we'll just have to deal with it, I suppose. Okay, now you're poisoned. I like that. Okay, good. Um... Let's go ahead with 
Lightning should do fine on you simply for the fact that you're a machine and that'll probably take more damage. I'm not entirely sure, but we'll see. Uh, let's see, keep up with the heal all here. Actually, you know, hang on. Um, heal. Yeah, Ume and October really need it. Yeah, I guess everyone really does, kind of. Okay, let's go ahead with a multi-strike and you continue with the silver bullet because it works. Actually, no, hang on. Uh, you could... 421... Yeah, let's keep up with the silver bullet. I was going to say do something else, but it seems to be working fine, so I'll take it. Multi-strike did good. Yeah, 516, it's not bad. Uh, let's see. Wait, is, is he actually poisoned or not? I can't tell. Okay, uh, let's see. It looks like Fireball might actually do more than Lightning, because it's not actually doing uh, as much as I would hope. Um... I'm going to go ahead and deadly kiss him one more time just to hope that he is poisoned just for sure. And then after that, we'll worry about other stuff. Okay, let's see how much the wind strike does on him. Silver bullet, good stuff. Wind strike, eh, it cuts the damage by a pretty fair amount, I think. Okay, you are poisoned, good. Okay, good. That works. Now, uh, keep up with the lightning there. Keep up with the heal all. Actually, you know what? Uh, how about we just go for a straight uh, heal on October because she can actually use that. Okay, let's see. Wind strike. Actually, wind strike didn't do that much less than I thought it did. I want to see how much dark strike is going to do. That could do a lot, and it could do absolutely nothing. I'm not sure. Okay, that did very slightly less than uh, what I advertised, but not by much. Okay, I'll take it. That's fine. Okay, what's your attack at? Uh, 10,000. You're almost. T you're a little over half dead. I'll take it. Okay, so let's continue on with the fireball. See how well that does. Uh, let's continue on with the heal all here. Actually, no, hang on. Let's see who needs it. Pretty much just alone. Okay, good. Let's do that. You go with the. Uh. Let's go with the multi-strike, and then you go with the silver bolt again. There we go. Perfect. Okay, the fireball definitely does more damage. Okay, I'll definitely use that then. All right, you're doing pretty good then. Okay, fireball. Let's go with a, who needs it? Just you, I guess, okay. Uh, continue up with the multi-strike. You, go ahead with a blood drain, just to recover your HP just a little bit. There we go. Ow. Okay, that's because you got three of your machine gun hits out of four on one target, so that helped. And by help, I mean screw you. Okay, uh, you continue on with the fireball spam. You go with the... Death Blow. And then you go with the potion on Ilona there. There we go. Nice. Ow. Okay, she, this guy's just about dead, so I'm going to go ahead and, uh, let's see, smash, yeah, let's do that. Let's do a uh, dark strike, that should just about finish him off, a silver bullet should be perfect. Yes, got him. Alright, October, what do we got? Uh, 30 strength, 40 magic, HP and MP, uh, the magic's nice, let's do that. Ilona, drain, passive ability, adds life drain, ability to regular attack, that's not too bad. Or 60 magic. Oh wow, that's really nice. Honestly, Alona does not do very much in the department of just straight up physical attacking. Um, and as far as I can tell, regular attack just means regular attack. I mean, it's she only ever does regular attacks on like uh, if I'm lazy and finishing up like a very small, like a last bit of groups of enemies. For the most part, she'll be doing healing or smashing or whatever. So I think I'd rather just have the straight up uh, magic for again the much better heals. So let's do that. Ume, let's see. All stats or MP. Uh, let's go with all stats. Why not? Molly targets one enemy for more damage. Or Quake targets all enemies. Yeah, let's do that. You may have destroyed me, but I shall have my revenge. Initiate ship self-destruct sequence. Ah, what will we do? I'm too beautiful to die. Molly pulls out her cell phone and pushes a few buttons. Quick, everyone, into the cell phone portal. 
You escape through the portal just before the spaceship crashes into the river below. I'm still alive! Molly? Yes? If you have a device that creates portals, why haven't we been using it? That's easy. I don't want to waste the battery. Oh. Yes, you saved the world, but by, by proxy, that means I have to save the world. I'm a true hero. Not exactly. When you're dealing with proxy hero work, it takes a lot more acts of heroism than normal for it to count. Thaaa! The craft spaceship has opened up a new path. I'll work to the next city and further acts of her heroism. Yay. Okay. Let's go ahead and... This is not what I was going for. Uh, let's see. Further... This way? Yes, yeah, this way. Okay, cool. Alright, uh... Where is our new city destination? Do I really care about you guys? I don't think I do. Okay, let's, uh, Tempest. Let's, uh... Mawfish, let's, uh, let's see, Blood Wave, and let's Quake. Ah, that's nice. I love it. It's not the, it's not the best multi-target attack, but hey, it's the multi-target attack, and that's all that counts. Okay, I want to find a nice town to get to. It should be over here somewhere, right? Uh, okay, go away. Uh, Scream Cone, cool, I like that. Let's see, Fireball, you guys have barely any HP, so that's fine. Okay, let's go Tempest, let's go uh, you go with the... I guess some Uh You go with your Blood Wave, and you go with your Quake. Very nice, I like it. Ah, nice little AoE killing machine. Where are we? Oh, this is that uh, Cave of uh, Graves, I think, right? I think it's that cave of grave area. I mean, I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's the general idea of where we are here. Swamp of Despair. Yeah, it's only 10 battles. Uh, okay, next episode we'll go ahead and uh, kind of fight our way through here. Uh, I might not show all the battles, I might show like one or two and then just uh, find the treasures. But after that, we'll go ahead and find more cities to uh, plunder and not destroy, save I guess. So guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good night.